Well, Macon has a few karate kids that will be on their way to a major annual championship. Our Brianna Cook chopped up a few moves of her own with those karate instructors today. Ten Macon kids will be doing cool moves like that at the World Championship. <laughs> Macon will be represented at the annual World Karate Commission World Championships. The young Macon Knights earned their spot after competing in Detroit several weeks ago. Timothy Conkle, co-owner of New Heights Karate Studio, says they've been working hard to reach this moment. Our students going to the World Championships and competing, representing Macon, Georgia, of all places, uh, is, is a dream come true. With the kids ages ranging from 9 years old to 18, they've worked their way up to being a black belt over the years. Not only have the 10 black belt karate kids made it to the world championships, but also the co-owners of the karate studio. Rissa Kalar, co-owner of the studio, says she wants the kids to remember they can accomplish anything they put their minds to. Remember that they are already a champion. They, they, they already earned that spot. All they have to do is just show everybody else, like, who they are. More than 30 countries will compete for the world championship title and earn gold medals in traditional weapons, forms, extreme forms, sparring, and many more. Every country selects the top qualifying martial artists to represent at the WKC World Championship. Kalar says their doors are always open for more middle Georgia kids interested in karate, but it is not like the movies. Kids come in and they like they think of karate and think Power Rangers, Ninja Turtles, uh, superheroes and everything. It's not just about the kicking and punching. They're going to have to learn hard work. They're going to have to learn discipline, uh, respect. All those attributes have formed the 10 students headed to the championships. The team will continue to train in the coming months in preparation for the world championship. Conco says win or lose, they will be putting Macon on the map. Uh, this is where I grew up. I'm, uh, you know, born and raised in this area. And... Uh, to be able to uh, travel around the world competing and then bring all that back to uh, to a community that means so much to me is a uh, it's like it's a life dream it's a life goal so uh, um, we're gonna we're accomplishing great things. You can find them kicking it into high gear at the World Championships in October in Orlando. Reporting in Macon, Brianna Cook, WGXA News.